Hi everybody. Today I'd like to do a review, not of my kit here, because you've all seen this kit before, if you've seen my other videos. But I'd like to do a review of the new canteen cup stove that I'm carrying. If you haven't seen this kit before, uh, check out my other videos and you will see what all is in the kit. But today what I'd like to look at is a new canteen cup stove that uh, I've been using for about a month now. It's made by the canteen shop and it is a version of the US military canteen cup what they've done is they've made a number of changes that actually make it uh, really really nice they've made it out of one piece of steel instead of if you look at the older style canteen cup uh, stoves they're made out of just one thin piece of sheet metal that's got some holes in it and the canteen cup actually sits down in the stove like that the problem is when you're using it, when you pick up the stove, you can very easily, when you pick up your cup, you can very easily pick up the stove too. And that's not always so good. And if you want to knock the stove off, this is real hot so you can tend to burn yourself. And they're also not real heavy duty. If you notice, they bend pretty easily. They'll bend back, but that is the downside of these. Now back to uh, the canteen the canteen shop canteen stove they've done a couple of really neat things with this first of all they drilled out a hole pattern on the bottom you can see there and they've raised four of those holes by pressing them out you can see how those actually stand up from the stove so when you're actually using this stove the flames don't just stop at the edge of the stove, they actually come up through this grate. And I'm going to quick show you how that works with my alcohol stove. Put a little bit of fuel in here. Don't really need a lot because I'm just going to demonstrate this. Fill it, and then I'm going to prime it on the sides. Again, this is nothing new if you've been watching my other videos. Put the screw back in. Now I'm going to light the stove. And you'll see very, very quickly that as this stove starts to blossom, see those flames come right through the burner. And now if I wanted to put my canteen cup on, Put a little bit of water in the canteen cup. You can see it's a nice stable surface. I'm going to blow the stove out so it doesn't get too hot. But it gives you a nice stable surface. The flames come up around the cup. It heats water very, very quickly. Uh, boil times are sometimes less than five minutes if I've got nice conditions out. This is extremely heavy duty. If I wanted to push down on this stove, uh, I've supported you know 20 pounds worth of cinder blocks on it. Never ever had an issue with it. It's built pretty much like a tank. See on the inside it, it forms a cup so you could even use it for gathering things like berries or other things that you might want to hold in the cup. You can, um, I've seen videos where people use this actually as a lantern when they used it in conjunction with the boil lid. 
because the boil lid fits down on top of this thing and what I've seen them actually do is I've seen them actually put the I put a candle inside of here and then when this is set it'll be difficult now there we go when this is set in place you can carry it by this handle put a candle inside the bottom here and it will throw a surprising amount of light so that is the canteen shop canteen stove very heavy duty great little product very efficient not really all that heavy maybe a couple of ounces heavier than just the old uh, military style one but it's a great product uh, if you pick one up I will guarantee you you will not be sorry so that's what I want to share with you today thank you for watching my video I hope you enjoyed the video and learned something have a great day, and hey, take your kids camping.